So, what do you think of the airplane bathroom? Good. Well, I've been running around like a crazy person this morning. There's just so much to do to be ready to go. I think the kids almost have all their clothes laid out. I'm definitely done with the laundry. All the kids got bathed. I have obviously not gotten myself ready. Jeremy's showering right now. I think we're getting there. We have one hour till go time. What are we doing this morning, Isaac? Planting the sunflowers. This one's Damien. He has a nickname, Daddy Dame and then Destiny. All right, let's go plant Damien and Destiny. So because we're heading out on our trip this morning, we gotta get these sunflowers planted before we go. Let's go get packed. So far the kids have actually been super helpful this morning. They are so excited. Are you girls pretending to ride on the airplane? Yeah. Looks like it's a bumpy ride. Yeah. Don't get off the plane! Yes! Yeah! The rooster! Ah! 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 Get a parachute! Ah! Gotta get back on. Ah! So we have everything in the car. And then I realized I didn't have my wallet. No driver's license. Can't fly. No money. A little bit important. Ah! We made it out of the door on time and we get in the car and I'm like, Jeremy, we did it. He goes, babe, we just got started. So it's true, we have a whole day's travel ahead of us. We're driving to the airport now and then we have to fly and then drive. Hopefully we make it. Luckily this time, there's no tornadoes. So since this is our first time traveling with all five kids, my sister-in-law is being awesome and meeting us at the airport and just helping us get like from the car all the baggage, all the kids checked in and ready to go. One of the bags that we have packed is full of the service items that were made for Days for Girls a couple months ago, and they are getting ready to go to Africa with my sister next month. fly what we have to do is have Jeremy drive all of us up drop everything off and then go park the van in economy parking we found that's easier than lugging all of our stuff on the shuttle and our family is just big enough we can't really have somebody drive us and drop us off at the airport Well, I'm feeling really grateful for the help right now. We have so much stuff here between car seats and suitcases and kids. Here we go. Caleb, you are such a hard worker. Janae is doing her part by sleeping. Thanks for coming. Bye. So we just had a scare at the ticket counter. They wouldn't let Janae fly without proof of age and identification, which we don't have for her because we don't even have her birth certificate yet. So luckily we were able to contact our doctor's office and they faxed over something that worked, but it made me really nervous because our plane is going to board and she needs to come with us. But they didn't need that information two weeks ago when we flew. We've flown a lot with our kids and I've never been asked for that before, but apparently they need proof that she's not two years old. Can you put it back? Can you bend? Janae's ready for her flight. I love this part, it's my favorite part because I always put my hands up and it goes really fast. Your your girls are pretty excited. Oh, you this is what Papa does when he's excited. This is what Papa does when he's excited. This is it. We're going to start flying. Yeah. Papa, go the ground. <laughs> it feels like you're going to It's like a dream. I feel like I'm going down. Do you guys want to see the new 
toy. So, what do you think of the airplane bathroom? Good. Changing diapers on the plane is awesome. Everything's so tiny from up here. We're going to get our final descent into Phoenix. Make sure your seatbelts are fastened. Has anyone ever died in a plane before? Let's talk about it after we're on the ground, okay? Go ahead, come. It is hot in here. Yep, it's over 100 degrees in Phoenix. All right, I think we have it all. Well, we're so lucky. Aunt Tiffany is taking three of our kids and most of our luggage. So we just have Jeremy, Janae, and I, and Two kids, two car seats. We don't know what to do with ourselves. We might be on vacation. So Tiffany came to help us out. She knows how hard it is to load all the luggage and all the kids into the rental car things. And so she has some of the kids for us. We are in the longest line ever. Janae's happy about it. <laughs> That's the line. You editing a movie, buddy? Little movie maker right here. We went with the minivan. It's hard to fit all seven of us in the cool sports car. Well, it officially took us longer to get our rental car than it took for us to fly to Arizona. The good part is this was still a lot faster than if we'd driven to Arizona. For sure. Yay, welcome to Arizona. Traffic. <laughs> rental cars, you gotta like figure out air How to do it. They're always more high tech than our car, so we're like, what's this? <laughs> we made it to my sister's house and Caleb has to pee really bad, so we're hurrying inside. Run, 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 run to the front door. We came to visit my dad real quick. He's moving today. And so I helped put some stuff in. He's actually moving to Tennessee. Say goodbye to Poppy Rod. Yeah, just got to meet him. Yeah, for the first know, time. already, huh? Look at you. Say bye bye. Wait. There you go. <laughs> there <was a> <laughs> Janae's getting to meet all of her cousins. Well, we made it to my sister Tiffany's house and it's really fun because she moved to a new house recently so we haven't been here before so we got to get the grand tour and see everything and the minute we got here, the kids are all just playing. What is this madness? My Pokemon. These are your Pokemon? Yeah. Isaac, what do you think? I think it's pretty cool. Show us how it works, Caleb. Oh, how'd you turn on the light? Is it I automatic? Did. Okay, so my sister's bathrooms have these awesome automatic sensors in them, and so you don't even have to turn it on. Oh, hi, Snickers. Whoa. <laughs> Say goodnight, Snickers. Say sweet time. So my sister's house has this awesome setup where there's two bedrooms and a little kitchenette and a living area and a bathroom all in one part of the house. And so she's just giving us this space so we can spread out. The kids can hopefully all sleep well tonight. Jay, how's up? It's the last day of school, Cub. Get up. Good morning. Good morning, Mommy. Good morning, Cubby. 
Isaac, get your flip flops on and hop in the car. Come on. We're going somewhere.